What's up guys, Ken Blocks here. In this video, I will show you how to level up fast in First C using Light Fruit. This fruit is widely considered as an exceptional choice for grinding due to its an elemental fruit and its ability to perform area of effect moves. It possesses decent damage, manageable mastery requirements, a potent basic attack, and the fastest flight speed in the game. For grinding purposes in the first C, it is highly recommended. Before we proceed, a big shout out to this guys. Without further ado, let's go. First objective is the bandits. Lure the mobs. Then use your basic attack to kill the mobs. Elemental immunity is in effect at level 5. Our goal here is level 15. We unlock the F skill. Stats check. Our next objective is the galley pirates in Fountain City. This is how I kill a galley pirate. Lure and use the wall strategy to attack the mob. Use your basic attack only. You will get a lot of EXP here. Our goal here is level 45. We unlock the X skill. Stats check. Our next objective is the Brutes in the Pirate Village. Elemental immunity is in effect. Our goal here is level 55. Stats check. Next objective is the Boss Bobby from the same quest giver. This is how I kill the boss. Take the quest, kill, server hop, and repeat. Our goal here is level 75. Stats check. Before go into the next objective, go to Frozen Island first and buy Space Jump and Aura from the Ability Teacher. Then go to Marine Fortress to buy the Black Cape. The buffs of Black Cape are 5% more damage on any attack, 100 energy, and 100 health. And now, let's proceed to our next objective. Next objective is the Desert Officers in Desert. Elemental Immunity is in effect. Our goal here is level 90. I'm only using basic attack because it is faster to kill them than using skills. This is how I do my rotation. Stats check. Before go into the next objective, 
Go back to the Ability Teacher to buy the Flash Step. Next objective is the Snow Bandits in Frozen Village. Elemental Immunity is in effect. This is how I do my rotation. Our goal here is level 105. Stats check. Next objective is the Boss Yeti. From the same quest giver in Frozen Village. I forgot to mention that the elemental immunity effect will not work on bosses and mobs with aura. Go back to Yeti. It's so easy to kill the boss. Just use M1 plus one dash on the ice to attack. Then use your range skills every time the boss uses his skill. Our goal here is level 130. This is how I kill the boss. Stats check. Our next objective is the boss vice admiral in Marine Fortress. Our goal here is level 192. This is how I kill the boss. First, use your range skill to lure him here. Use the wall strategy advantage to attack the boss by using your basic attack. We unlock the C skill, Reflection Kick. Stats check. Next objective is the prisoners in Prison Island. Elemental immunity is in effect. Our goal here is level to 112. This is how I do my rotation. Stats check. Our next objective is the Dangerous Prisoners. From the same quest giver. Elemental immunity is in effect. Our goal here is level to 120. This is how I do my rotation. Stats check. Our next objective is the Boss Warden in Prison Island. Our goal here is level to 130. This is how I kill the Boss Warden. I lure the boss here and attack him using the wall strategy advantage. Stats check. Next objectives at level 230 are the Boss's Swan, Chief Warden, and Warden.
use the same strategy to all three bosses. Take the quest, kill, server hop, and repeat. Our goal here is level 350. Stats check. Before go into the next objective, we will get the instinct first. Our next objective is the Boss Magma Admiral in Magma Village. This is how I kill the boss. Keep your distance from the boss and use all of your skills. Same strategy. Take the quest, kill, server hop, and repeat. Our goal here is level 425. Stats check. Our next objective is the Fishman lore. Same strategy. Take the quest, kill, server hop, and repeat. Our goal is level 458. This is how I kill the boss. Lure the boss and use the wall strategy advantage. Stats check. Our next objective is the God's Guards in the upper yard of Skylands. Elemental immunity is in effect. This is how I do my rotation. Lure, then use V and X skills. Then just use your basic attack. Our goal is level 500. Stats check. Next is the boss Weisper in the upper yard of Skylands. This is how I kill the boss. Just stay on this bedrock and keep your distance. Check the boss, take the quest, kill, server hop, and repeat. Our goal is level 560. Stats check. Next objective is the Royal Soldier from the Last Quest Giver in the Upper Yard of Skylands. Elemental immunity is in effect. This is how I do my rotation. Lure the first three mobs, then use V and X skills. For the next two mobs, lure then use basic attacks. For the last three mobs, go to this position, then lure and use V and X skills. Our goal here is level 637. Stats check. Our last objective is the galley pirates in the Fountain City. Elemental immunity is in effect. 
This is how I do my rotation. Then use V and X skills. Wait for the mobs to spawn then lure. Our goal is level 741. So that, when you go to second C, elemental immunity will affect on mercenary mobs. Stats check. That's it guys. If you have questions, suggestions, or need help, just comment down below. Thank you for watching, enjoy gaming, and keep on grinding.